Hello there first, my name is DJ. Welcome to Resurrection. Today we're gonna be doing a um kind of release for an update. Um this one was kind of rushed out, but it's something that quickly patches a couple of interesting things that happened within the first couple of games. So as you guys know, the first game, second game, and maybe third game, I don't know how many we played on camera, but I think it was like three games. There was a lot of issues. Most of them have gotten fixed. I don't know of any that are still in the game right now, but also some interesting things have been added, nerfed, buffed, stuff like that. So without further ado, let's get into it. So let me uh, open up my book here. I have a whole like journal book thing dedicated to updates for this map, basically, or updates in general, but this map. So update 1.1. Obviously fixed chests around the map. Um, this chest got nerfed a little bit. Um, I think the watchtowers all got nerfed slightly. I think one of these I had to get rid of something. Let me see which one it was. Was it this one? Oh no, I already did that. Okay. Um, I was looking. Yeah, that's... Yeah, okay. So, there has been a bunch of more Quirrus Fruit added, along with just a bunch of random nerfs and stuff to make this map just that much more, you know, fun. Um, the middle chests, obviously all, most of them have Quirrus Fruits now. Well, I guess only three of them, but... Um, so yeah. Next, um, this is a the biggest problem of the map um this caused well it only happened to me i think but it was a big problem that would really ruin the game for whoever whatever terrible player would happen to come upon this so what it is is basically when using a chorus fruit i'll see if i can get it to do it on camera um well obviously it can't now but when using a chorus fruit i used it in the middle to just get away from players haven't tested this fully but when using a chorus fruit in the middle of the map here the cornucopia one time it put me um so it put me down here where all the redstone is i have filled this in so it's now it's oh shoot what is that doing i don't I don't know what that was doing, but we're missing one. I think the rascal got away. Anyway, um, this is all two block gaps now, or two block um. Why is this not uh turning on? I don't know but maybe if we clear out some dirt it'll do it for us there we go um so if we go up here it did it there's no holes in the ground or anything there it, it was just like I just literally ate it and it teleported me down there Well, how did that get up here? It's not gonna want to do it for me, obviously, but... You get the point. It teleports me down here. That, it was a glitch that I fortunately fixed, so... Let's just be happy that fixed. Um, but for... Uh, bleh, there is, um like one or two like one block gaps that could be removed but it for it's perfectly fine as it is basic I mean it's not perfectly you know what I'm saying it's good enough um I also fixed oh no not fixed but I added a crafting bench or a crafting table 
to the um to the workshop the the um yeah to the workshop so now you have this and you also have the little crafting table here so I was in here and I was looking for the crafting table I was like where did I put the crafting table I was like oh that's right I didn't put one in here so I thought I'd quickly put a crafting table inside of the uh, workshop so um oh yeah that's right I removed the feather fallers part as part of the um startup or starter kit you only have a compass knocker and bottles of enchanting now. But I did add feather fallers to every single one of the middle chests. And it's in the very direct it's in directly in the middle of every single cornucopia chest. Um, they're all the, exactly the same feather fallers. I feel like if you start with them, it, most people either don't go for mid or they just get like like go in here and just get like two things so I thought maybe it'll kind of drive them out of getting it so if, you know uh, just be careful because if you see someone with enchanted golden boots they might have a lava bucket or they might have golden apples they might have a really good you know they might have diamond stuff so with two chests you can make a diamond sword so they might have one uh, so yeah next um oh this is the biggest problem that we had so while playing the game somebody i think it was meyer was in this house okay there was originally ladders here and i placed lava down in the hole here so he couldn't get out luckily though he made a thousand iq move that i would have never seen he used a um use the chorus fruit to get out there's a lot of the chorus fruit um, problems right now but I mean it's not a problem it's good that he had that because he got out so now that he got out the lava was still there I took it back because I was like whatever so then I got the lava and when cichlids went in to get I don't know what I guess an anvil or an fix an item or something I don't know um apparently there was no ladders because the lava burned it so there's no fire spreads it just happened mm -hmm. oh we can also mm -hmm. keep it before he has been taken off I guess um so oh yeah the game mode is going to be set to survival not creative but so I fixed it right now this is the entry there is chorus fruits in here, so if you wanted to, actually, we're gonna we're gonna take these. We're gonna put them here. No one really checks that chest, so they might be like screwed. But now I made it so it's easier to get out. It's very clean. So when you go down, you're falling right down, but you have a little step here. That can get burned, so it's basically fireproof now. And even if you do get stuck in there, and somehow the metal grating or the metal gate or metal trap door gets burned i don't know how it would but if it does get burned you have the chorus fruits if two doesn't get you out i don't know what will so yeah that's basically it um i did tweak some some that tweaks some things and meyer said that there wasn't any um diamond sword i was like oh wait hold on they may have took they may have uh, taken the chest and I was like wait what house is it in because I was trying to think and I couldn't think so I was like I don't know what house is it I don't know what house it's in but now I remember that it's down here so at least ho hopefully that doesn't happen to me um diamond sword is in there bread let's get this bread gamers we're going to put villagers in here sometime later in the game but I just not yet I don't feel like uh, we'll, we'll do something as sort of like 1.7 where it's like you're getting a whole update kind of dedicated to the village that's what 1.7 was it added the array it added a bunch of villagers and stuff but it was mainly the the village and pillage update if you will um so yeah 
I also kind of tweaked some things here and there, added a couple, made this a bit bigger and actually I was planning on extending this a little bit, but I didn't do that. Um, that's about it. That's It's just a patch update. It patched a bunch of things. It I did add a crypt table with work chests or a workshop. I did tweak some things at the middle and the middle chests, but... Other than that, it was mainly a patch update. Just wanted to kind of throw that out there. So this is the patched. It's patched. Everything's fine. So um, we're also going to have the roadmap, the year one roadmap. And um, it's going to be really good. I heavily, heavily um, encourage you to check out the video. Should be the next uploaded video I, I uploaded channel really because it's really gonna be some greatness okay so make sure to um just just stay tuned okay it's gonna be the year one roadmap is basically gonna be like the year one roadmap for destiny it's gonna be there's gonna be a season season of the blank or not really season of the undying but it's gonna be like or the drifter it's gonna be similar to that but it's gonna be kind of like updates based. You you'll just have to watch the video. It's kind of complicated, but there's gonna be a year one roadmap, and there's something that's gonna be brought back that really never came into the game, but is bringing we're bringing back. So I would recommend watching the video because it's gonna be pretty nuts and insane. So thank you guys for watching. Um, if you have anything that you want me to patch, make sure to leave it in the comments. I don't know if there's anything that really needs fixed right now other than you know the size of the map and whatever we're gonna make it bigger and smaller here and there but for right now this is the size this is everything so yeah thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys next time peace out